This is purely an option, gentlemen. You can go home. We don't need you here. You can go home. Who wants to quit? Hell no! Who wants to quit? What? Hell no! What? morning go and do a base one. Oh yeah, bud! Uh, it's just uh, kicking for a thousand meters on our backs. Mm -hmm. No arms. All right. Got 22 minutes to do it. If you can't do it, they're sending you packing. It's the last chance to pass. Final base win. It's great at base win. Base win? I got past base win. Four. Four. I go home. Ready, set, go! Oh! A lot of people struggle with the base swim at first. At first, I think people were, were kicking just fine, but they were zigzagging across the bay, so they were doing twice as much work. Because you're, because you're on your back and you're not looking where you're going, so uh, you have to be looking at your feet or something to the side. And so at every moment in the base swim, you don't really think you have too much more, too much more to go. So for my final one, I was just hurting all over. The final stretch, I honestly don't really remember. 21-12. Woo! Yeah. Down and back, down and back. We're just going to keep kicking. Just giving it everything you have. Just keep kicking. Just keep kicking. Keep kicking. Don't stop kicking. Keep kicking as hard as you can. It's only 20 minutes of your life. The whole breath hold thing is that hard. It's situated. Hi, dog. What's going on right now? Uh, we're training for uh, pool week, just making sure we're ready. Uh, we're just doing a mock-up. we got fake tanks on. Um, and we're, uh, as you can see, we're running through and just hitting each other, uh, trying to prepare for what the instructor is going to be throwing at us. Uh, we'll be swimming along the bottom, and uh, they'll come up, tap us, and then uh, knock out our air, uh, rough us up a little bit, spin us around, disorient us, and get us ready for uh, what the open ocean is going to throw at us. I'm nervous. Uh, it's exciting, it's going to be fun. Uh, you know, it's a challenge that I've never done before, so I think all of us have the same mentality where we're just going to uh, grab by the horns and roll with it. So we're all a lot stronger than uh, what we were when we showed up. What do we got going on here today? First dive, man. Yeah. First open water dive, yeah. You pumped for it? Oh, I'm definitely pumped. Yeah. Ready to go. Good. Let's go. One, two, three. Check team one. Check team two. Check stand by. I'm going to do two different types of searches. I hear the visibility is pretty good down there. <laughs> I hear it's zero. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. How come? Because in the pool you can see. Look down. Look to the right. One, two, three, stop. Well, right now we have two guys in the water. The purpose of this is so they can find an object that's in the water. And right now, that's our class flag. So, when you get down there, it's pretty murky, zero visibility, and this is the first day we're doing this. So. for our uh, blue and gold t-shirts. Pretty big day for us. Yeah. It's kind of like your informal and formal uh, initiation into the diving community. Are you ready? We've, we've got people from way different backgrounds all coming together. And at first it's kind of, you don't really know what the school's about, like, am I going to make it? Was there ever a moment when you thought you might not make it? Uh, about once a day, at least. Maybe twice a day. Every day. Awesome! Presented to Naval Diving and Salvage Training Center to honor those graduates of U.S. Navy Dive Schools, past, present, and future, who go down in the sea to work. 
Julia, 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 Julia,